Hi guys, it's Nintendo Info here, and today I'm bringing some more Pokemon Y gameplay slash footage, and this is of um, me versus the champion, which is Diantha. So let's begin. So yeah, this is a live commentary, so I may not be very good at commentating over this because I don't know what's actually going to happen. Never actually faced this champion or watched anything on YouTube about um, a battle against Diant for the champion. So I've got my team all prepared, fully healed, and um, got the right... I think I've got the right Pokemon up front on the top left of my party. You're the child I spoke to in Lumio City and Camarina City. Aren't you? That means that then that means that you and you are also the one that dear Augustine said. Of course, how could I? Oh, I must look like such a fool not rec to recognise you sooner. You and your Pokemon are the ones who stopped Team Flare for us all. It seems wrong of me to say this, but thank you. You saved us all. I can't wait to see what you and your Pokemon are capable of now I, that I know exactly what it is you've already done. Versus Diantha, Pokemon League Champion. So yeah, all her um, team is Dragon-type Pokemon. No, is it Dragon-type? I'm sure well, I've got a whole archer. It's flying fighting, so... My whole archer is level... Oh, sorry. Level 67 at the minute, so three levels higher than hers. His sword stance. Come on, Ice Beam, super effective, I'm hoping. Yes, one hit KO. Nice start to the Champion Dant for battle. So, you're getting 2,400 XP points for that. Shared with my team, so I've got XP share on. Ty Tyrantran is coming out. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Just nudged the screen there. So we use Ice Beam. Hopefully super effective again. This is yes, so we're doing good here. Well done, Lapras. My lowest leveled Pokemon in my party. Again, 2,535 XP points and shared it with my party again. So send like Gudra, that is uh, Gumi's evolution, second evolution, or last evolution, I think. I think there's only there's only one evolution to it. So we're going to use Ice Beam again. We've only got two Ice Beams left. Oh man. Yes, avoided the attack. Great one, Lapras. Don't think it's going to be a one hit KO though. No, it is not. We're going to go. Ooh, this is a tough decision. I think I may go with Waterfall. I'm not sure if it's going to do anything really, to be honest. Hopefully, Focus Blast won't do too much to us. It is a psychic type move, I think. Oh, it was super effective. Come on, Waterfall. You can help me out here. I'm trying to save this Ice Blast. No, didn't really help out at all. Um, let's just go with the Ice Beam. I think we're going to have to use that. Oh, down to 16 HP. We're going to have to use a Hyper Potion after this move. So over there, Scoodra out the way. Nice. Uh, I think it's third Pokemon out. Two, uh, two one KOs. Two one hit KOs, sorry. Level 62. Oh, I thought it was already level 62, Lapras. Okay. Level 66, Evertool. Legendary for Pokemon Y, obviously. So I'm going to keep him out, even though he hasn't got his um, Ice Beam. He's got Sheer Cold, which has only got Frobes and Aggressive, so that's going to hit. We're going to go for a Hyper Potion. Oops, sorry. I just clicked on the Revive. So we're going to go with a Hyper Potion here. If I can find it, there it is. Yep, on Lapras. Oops, sorry, guys. So Lapras is really good, like, defensively with HP. It's got 262 HP at the minute at level 62. And I couldn't even, um, what's it called? Um, heal his HP up to full. I was going to say, if that hit, one hit KO. I'm going to go with another try with a hit. Doubt it's going to hit. No, don't think it was. Light screen protects itself, so may as well use anything, really. Let's just go with... Um, stuff. <laughs> oh, it hit. I thought life's being protected. Oh, okay. 
Thunder are uh, super effective against water, even though Lampras is water ice. Gonna go with Sheer Cold again. No, we've got one last try with Sheer Cold. Avoided the attack. Light Screen wore off, I think it said. Sheer Cold, nah, it's not gonna work. So we got our Ice Moves are out of PP. So we may as well try another Surf if we can get it. There we go. Hopefully get a critical hit at some point and then it may get Aurora us out. Oh no, not Thunder! Ah, 10 HP. We're going to use another Hyper Potion in a second. I'm so glad that I bought so many Hyper Potions. I actually bought them to last me longer than the Pokemon um, Elite Four and Champion. I actually just bought a load just so I don't have to keep buying them when I'm going through trainers and stuff like that. Oh, using Thunder again, probably 120 or HP gone on that. More than that, I expect. Oh no, less, 108. Oh, Paradise. Come on, you can move, Lapras. You've got to do good for me here. Got to get a critical hit with that Surf. Oh, not another Thunder. That's probably me out. I'm hoping it isn't. Oh, Lapras, sorry. Yep. Lapras done good for us. We're going to go with... Should we go with our strongest Pokemon? Or... Ooh, um... Might as well try to get Raichu out. Level 70 Raichu. So yeah, with my special Torchic event video, if you haven't watched that already, be sure to give that a like. Um, my Torchic involved into a Combuscan, then it's involved into a Blaziken, obviously. Yes, Aurora's fainted. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, Blaziken um, is levelling up like so quickly. He's like 11 levels higher than Raichu. He's like level 81, maybe 82. Just he's so quick at leveling up. You're just playing along and he's like level up. I'm like, oh okay. So I'm gonna go with um, a Thunderbolt. Use trick or treat. So we're gonna go with a uh, Electro Ball. It's not actually very effective against this Pokemon here. But um, we're just going to try to slowly knock his or, or hers actually HP down, just so it's a girl Pokemon. It's going to go with another electric ball, it won't actually hit because they're using Phantom Force, which my evil tool learnt. Fla Whoa. That did destroy a lot of HP off Raichu there, and I was quite worried, and he's out. Mm, damn. So I'm going to go over our strongest Pokemon here, Blaziken, level 81. We've also got Dalfox, level 71, Holacha, level 69, I think, 67, sorry. And I can't remember who else. Evertor, level 66. I'm going to go over Mega Evolution, Sky Uppercut. Well, you know, Mega Evolution, then Sky Uppercut as the fighting type move. The only fighting type move that Blaziken has learnt, that I, well, I've allowed him to learn. He's got two fire type moves, I think, and a flying type move, which is Brave Bird, which is really effective actually sometimes. It doesn't affect? Well, I didn't know that. I haven't actually looked up about that Gore Guest Pokemon. Ghost type was added to Blaziken. It's going to go with Brave Bird actually, to see what's effective against this Pokemon here. I think this Brave Bird's got 120 power, I'm not quite sure. Super effective, I should just use that in the in the long run, or well, fast, so. 3,613 3, XP points, whoa, that's a lot. So no, Gardevoir. <laughs> Gardevoir's coming out. Hopefully use... Maybe go Flare Blitz, actually, yeah. Let's go Flare Blitz. Oh, Mega Evolution! Our highest level Pokemon guard if was got Mega Evolution! Level 68. I'm hoping I do good against it. I've got my Mega Evolution Blaziken level 81. 13 levels higher. Hopefully it's going to do quite good here. Oh, one-hitted! One KO against the Mega Evolution highest Pokemon off Champion Deamphas. Guard of War, level 82 Blaziken. With 5,800 XP plus, I think that just got. Level 68 Halucha. Level 72 Delphox. 
Unifeated Champion, Deampha.